What's going on everybody? Beastly Gamer here. Today I'm joined by... Miss Everything Random. And today we're going to be doing episode 2 of What's That Taste Like? Today I wanted to uh, delve deep and try something that I know I'd never try here in the States. Something that I figured she might be scared to try. And so why don't you show everybody what we got today. That's called Nori Maki Arar. And uh, what this is, what is it? Why don't you tell it's me what a it? rice cracker wrapped in seaweed. Yeah, well, it's a rice cracker wrapped in seaweed. Now, I've this, never had seaweed before. I'm, I'm sure many, many people in America haven't. I, I, I've had seaweed before. I used to work in a produce department at a local Publix years ago. Uh, and it's, uh, it's an acquired taste. Now, this is actually something that's considered a snack food. Uh, in its native land, and there's no no MSG <laughs> added. Now, that's if, important. if you guys look at them, they look look a little funky. I don't know what it's going to smell like. It's extremely light. This little pack is uh, three ounces, and so let's see. What is the serving? What, the serving is what 19? 19, ni oh, wow. 19 pieces of this. So you got to torture yourself. 19. Uh, just joke. I don't know if it's good or not. So we're going to go ahead and open these up. And uh, why don't you do the eyes? Open them up and let's see what they taste like. Keep our fingers crossed. You know, last time I was really surprised and pleasantly surprised with that, uh, the Kit Kat, the green tea Kit Kat. Oh, I'm still addicted. They're delicious. I had to go back and get another bag of those bad boys. Ten dollars a pop, man. All right, all, all one is one. It's all ours. What if you like it? If I like you it, have I'll, more. If, I, if I like it, I'll go back for another. Wow, it really is seaweed. Jeez. Yep, it's seaweed. Look at that. Boy, boy, boy. Mine, yours is bigger than mine. <laughs> First time for everything, huh? Freak. All right, so. It feels very airy, so I don't think there's much. It's rice. What does it smell like? Um, I don't know what seaweed smells it like. It smells like, so. it smells like a roasted it's yeah, like, it's like, like honey. You smell this versus. like if you walk into a Thai restaurant or something. Where did this shit come from? Uh, this product of China, distributed by JFC International. Alright, All right, JFC, you ready to try this in the country? Alright, Chinese. One, two, or. Uh, let's say this first. Domo arigato gozaimasu. No, that's Japanese. Alright, let's taste it. It's probably it. a different country. It's very dry. Um, you can tell there's a vegetable on it. Or seaweed. Vegetable. Maybe this is why I'm so overweight. I don't like this. It's, uh... Yeah. The rice cracker isn't all that great. Either. Oh. What it, it tastes like something here. In the aftertaste. Like, after a while... You, you licked ass before or something? This is terrible. No. It tastes like a food here in the States. I just can't think of it. <sighs> uh, yeah, dog food. No wonder these are um, 19 pieces per serving because it just tastes so healthy for you. But it doesn't taste good. Very good. You shoved the whole thing in your mouth. I couldn't do it. I had I'm a man. It. I kind of want to take taste it again so I can really get I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to try one more. I'm going to try one more. All right. I'm going I'm to do this for the home team. You know, i gotta, I got to hold up my blunt before I smoke it. All right, so. It looks like well-made, you know, Chinese craftsmanship. Someone, oh, see? Someone did I this can't by, do it. Someone did it by hand. Someone took pride in wrapping seaweed on this little bubble rice. Rice cracker. I mean, what, maybe a rice cake? Maybe? It's worse, like... If you look, if you look at them, they look like they have oh. honey. Or something. They look like there's something sweet on. They no, nothing sweet at all. They smell like. It smells like if you go into like a, a dog show or something. Maybe a treat they give a dog. That's no. what it smells. <clears throat> I used to work at Jack Pap's Dog Service in Ohio. His dog's names were Hannibal, Terry, and something else, a poodle. And their treats <laughs> smell just like this shit. <laughs> Let me see. I couldn't. Wait, 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 one more. 
I just, I can't sit around eating mm. these. I couldn't do it. I don't know why someone would go oh. to the store and choose these. It, it's like, uh, I want to say, I feel like I'm in jail. Like, I feel like if I was in a Chinese prison camp. This is what they have feed you. He said, you big black man. Got these for you. Uh, that's how I feel. That's all you get to eat. That's it. Yeah, these are not good. Can't do it. Nope. Ah, uh, I'm going to uh, let my daughters probably try them. But yeah, these are no. I give, I give it a score of a two. I'll go a three because I'm sure there's probably a lot worse shit out there. I give it a two because, and I only give it a two not because of taste, because it it just seems healthy for you. You know, I'll go outside and eat grass too. I'm not gonna give that a two. Um. I'll, I'll go ahead and give these a three. Uh, Noramaki Arara. I hope I'm saying that right. I'm not going to totally trash them, <clears throat> but for my 35 year old taste, it's something so different. Um, and so. Yuck. I just, I just didn't enjoy it. So now you guys know what Noramaki Arara tastes like. Stay away from it, guys. Yeah, don't taste it. <laughs> hmm. Alright, so. We got one more thing to, to do today on today's show. <laughs> Thank God it's on liquid. Yeah. I'm, I'm going to wash this uh, Noramaki down. Away. Oh, this is called Kakoya Coconut Juice. That's right. And, uh, With pulp. And it has pulp in it. Um, and I'm not a big coconut drinker. We actually had another thing we wanted to try today, but it was actually a coconut... Uh, coconut dessert and I didn't want the uh, coconut from the coconut drink. Coconut mixing with coconut. Yeah and that way you won't tell if one coconut's good and one coconut's bad. You can't mix your nuts. You know you gotta keep your good nuts keep them separate. With your bad nuts. Alright. Away from your bad nuts. Alright so we're gonna crack these open. Crack this open. This is a pretty big and if I don't like it I'm not gonna drink it. Just letting you guys know. So we got two glasses. The first ingredient is young coconut juice water. Oh wow it really is. Hold on. I gotta show them. So it's young coconut, and we live in Atlanta, so someone's probably being murdered if you guys hear the, uh, the police sirens. All right, so coconut juice with pulp. Why don't you hold it up so you can see what it looks like going into the glass? You hold the glass. There you go. There you got another camera over there. All right, here we go. Oh, that looks appetizing. Um, okay, that's enough. All right, so <laughs> show, show them what that looks like on the inside. It looks like backwash water. It looks like uh, a sauna, or no, it looks like um, a jacuzzi that someone, a group of people did some stuff at. Yeah, that's what that looks like. All right. And I'm not speaking from... Oh, wow. I'm not speaking from experience. I've never been in a jacuzzi with a whole bunch of people. Straight uh, coconut smell. It's like a sweetened coconut. Oh, yeah, it does smell good. Hmm. You see that? You see that? Uh, did you, did you just have some cornbread? Cause I see something in my drink. Yeah, it's one of those. They used to actually have a drink years ago. They came in a bottle. I forget the name of it, but it had little tiny balls in it. Balls? Not balls, but it had little tiny little <laughs> things floating, balls. floating around in it, like little things you could see. And this stuff, it seems to be sitting in the same place. It's actually not moving. I'm wondering what the oh, hell wow. I'm drinking. They're not moving, son. You see that? This is the Matrix. We have entered, entered the Matrix. Let me see if I got something stuck in the back of my big ass head. All right, you know. All right, so cheers. Let's break these glasses and that way we can back out of drinking this. <laughs> Whatever it is. I'm not going to chicken out. Mm -hmm. Okay. Sweet. Goodbye, Noramaki. Bitch. All right, it's, so. It's sweet. Very sweet. It's like. All right, the the juice is actually good. It tastes like it's uh, real coconut juice. It's like premium coconut. It's like it fell out of the tree, cracked on top of my head, and it just fell into a glass. Uh, cast away. Mm. Oh, Spalding. Mm. It's like, it's very weird from what I've ever tasted before, but it's like I can't stop drinking it. I want to keep going back for some reason. Oh, so you like this consistency. Mmm, now I know in the future. All right. Ah, it's very refreshing, especially oh, after this. 
Oh, are they falling out of the bag? Oh, that means we're gonna have to throw those away, honey. We're gonna have to throw them away. Alright, so I will give the Kokoya Premium Coconut Juice a score. Well, let's talk about the little, uh, the floaters. I don't, really, I don't, they just kind of go down with the water, so. <laughs> <laughs> They're just going down, huh? So I got one. It'd be crazy if it stayed in the same place in your mouth the way it does in the glass, huh? Try to swallow it and just stay up in your mouth. <laughs> See, I never had an actual coconut. Yes, you had. I ate an actual coconut before? You call it that in the hood. Anyway, on the, on the scale of 1 to 10, <laughs> she ain't never had no coconut, y'all. <laughs> on a scale of 1 to 10, I want to give this drink a 7. Uh, I think that the, it's very refreshing as far as the actual liquid goes. And the little chunks of coconut love. Uh, it kind of tastes like you're eating a, coconut. eating a coconut, I'm assuming. I don't know what a coconut tastes like. Well, then no, you do. Because <laughs> this is what a coconut tastes like. Yeah, but do they add anything to it or is this just straight coconut? It's straight coconut mixed with a little bit of questionable coconut. All right, so the ingredients are young. <laughs> Maybe a bi coconut. Young, yeah, bi coconuts. There's two. All right, so we got young coconut juice, water, sugar, young coconut pulp, because if it gets old and the pulp <laughs> gets wrinkled. It's yucky. Sodium and a word that I can't pronounce as a preservative. So okay, so it's, it's not pre- all it's natural pre- flavor. It's pretty close. It's pretty close to, to, to coconut juice. And, uh, well, it's pretty tasty. Yeah, I, it, uh, I agree. I give it a seven. I think that it's uh, probably a lot better for us than the uh, myriad of crap that we buy here in America. It's so, all saturated fats. Here's a cheers to you. And it's a drink that doesn't know. Well, this has been episode two of What's That Taste Like? We gave you two for two. Hope you guys enjoy it. Please show some support to the video by hitting that thumbs up button. And if you're new to the channel, subscribe to the Beastly Gamer channel, subscribe to Miss Everything Random. I'm the Beastly Gamer. And I'm Miss Everything Random. And we'll see you guys next time. Bye guys.